two, one, go! And we are underway, ladies and gentlemen. This is semifinal match one. The Baxter machine, 3015, quickly tries to add fuel to the boiler through the high efficiency goal. Period comes to a close. We're tied up 76 all. Two very evenly matched alliances with robots capable of completing all of the tasks. Far side of the field, 156 empties fuel from the hopper out onto the field of play. Racing through all the debris is first team 2010. They maneuver their way into the blue alliance retrieval zone, grabbing a gear. Now they have to take on the red alliance defender 156. Their alliance partner 2614 helps them out. And now 210 has an opening to squeeze through. Team CIA and their alliance partner both make it through with gears in tow. And now look for a way to add those gears or pass those gears off to the pilots aboard the airships. 30-15 in a defensive stance, pushing and shoving, trying to keep those robots out of position at the base of the Blue Alliance airship. In the meantime, on the Red Alliance airship, two rotors now turning. Crew spins up a third rotor. Red Alliance with a big time lead, 161 to 116. Less than a minute remaining, but there is still time. CIA on the move with another gear in its possession. Trying to place the gear on the peg. Lift being pulled up. Pilots aboard the Blue Alliance airship have it. They add it to the gear chain. Ropes are being deployed by the Blue Alliance pilots. Red Alliance pilots doing the same. Red Alliance is on fire with one, two. Robots indicating that they are ready for flight. A third one trying to climb on board. Team CIA ready for flight. All three Red or Blue Alliance robots are up. All three have secured a place. Final seconds. Time has expired. On and ladies and gentlemen, Blue Alliance was behind and not just by a little bit. They were way behind, but they came on strong in the closing seconds and stole this one away. 266 to 261. Blue Alliance is.